good morning everyone let me strip my camera out because there's all kinds of crooked and i didn't know it and it's still crooked there we go uh there we go hey how are y'all doing misty here and i am doing number two that's four but anyway number two craft with me artsology design team project how y'all be i have decided that with ballerina stuff i think bows incorporate well in there i'm not a bow person i don't think that's my phone let me turn that down i don't think bows go with everything but for this they go quite well so i've been making some simple little bows like this one here it's just too cute and then I made this itty bitty one. Well, it's not itty bitty, but it's a small one. So I wanted to make some of these to go in my journal for this month. And um, I thought I would come on here and show you guys how I make these bows. They're very simple. You don't need a whole lot of uh, stuff for these. Just some lace material and some string. So... I'm going to cut just a piece of lace and then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fold it like this simple right and then I'm going to take my string no I'm not I'm going to take it and fold it and then I'm just going to crinkle it up gather it in the center like that and I'm going to take my string do I want to use this one let me see yeah, we'll use this one. And I'm going to wrap it around and pulling it tight. And then I'm going to tie it or try to tie it like that. There we go. And then before I do any more, I want to make sure it's kind of even. Just kind of. I don't want it perfect, but I want it to look right. It looks good to me. So, and then I'm going to tie it again. This is just a simple way to make these guys. Um, no sewing. Nothing like that. Just a simple little bow. That I anybody can make. Honestly. And again, it's a way to use up some of your scraps. That you've got you can just make these simple little bows and they'd go cute on cards or whatever whatever you know you use bows for just like that now I'm gonna trim this thread off here Oop. come on Misty don't cut your finger there we go and you have a cute little bow. Doesn't take no time at all to make them. And then you can add bling or whatever you want to in the center of it. Um, I thought these would be really cute. Let me grab some of my stuff here. See what I got. Like, let me see. I know I got some tabs. Like, here's a tab. This is um, from my ballerina kit that I'm working with. From Deb. Go check her out, guys. Them links are down below. Down below. And I thought on a tab that'd be cute here on the edge. You know, you've got like this journal card. Throw a bow here. It'd be cute little, just a simple little embellishment. You know, nothing really um, bulky or, or or whatever you know just if you just want something simple this would be perfect for your uh for your projects here um also you could take like i've got some tags here of deb's and you could take instead of using um string or whatever you could just put a little bow up here at the top if you want to Preferably not a real bulky one because then it will bulk up your uh, 
your journal, your pages won't sit right. Like you could take this one here and just put here, you know, so that these bows would be absolutely adorable in this journal and, and really in any project that you're doing. I think anyway. So I want to make another one and I got to find my stuff what I want to use for it. Uh, let's see. What do I got? What do I got? I got all kinds of stuff. Like, ooh, I got this ribbon. Let's use some of this. How about we cut that much off? Ooh. Okay. I want to try some. I've never, I've never tried this before, but we're going to try to, um, like, make a layered bow. Why not? What do I have to lose, people? Nothing. Nothing at all. Trim this down. I think I want to leave a little hanging over the edge, maybe. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. We're going to try it, see what happens. You don't know until you, until you try it. Okay. Get out of here. Oh, I need string. Let's see, we're going to use this here. Okay, piece that off. Alright, so just like the other one, you're just going to fold this kind of in half to where the back meets, the back pieces. And let's do that. Get in there. Okay. Now we're going to take our string and we're going to wrap it around the center of this bow. And you want to make sure it looks at least semi-even. I mean on the sides, you guys. You don't want it to look all, you know, blacky, I guess. I don't know what word to use. We're going to use Blackie this morning because, well, because I can. Okay. All right. So, let's go ahead and tie this and see how this looks. I think it's going to look all right, honestly. I think it is. At least I like it. And, uh. You know, that's important. If you can't like the things that you make, then you probably shouldn't be crafting. Sometimes we got to be our own cheerleader. All right, come on, tie. Really, Misty, get it together. There, it worked that time. All right. And then I think I'm just going to leave that string on there. So, straighten out our bow here, our little pieces, make it look all shabified or whatever word you want to use, we're going to use shabified, because, you know, we can. Alright, y'all, that turned out to be a cute bow. I like it. I think it looks awesome. All right, let me grab a drink here, you guys. My. All right, so there is another, another cute bow. And I have a card that. No, I think that'll look cute on this one. Put it up here at the edge. You know, if you want to, or wherever you want to put them in your journal. I mean, it, it really doesn't matter. I think I like these little bows. Put them like this on these uh, tabs. I think that will look very cute. So you got some of that hanging out the side. You do it like this. Have it hanging on the inside, and that way when it's on the edge of your on the edge of your page, like let's grab this piece of paper. Okay, so this is your your, your one of your signatures have this glued on the edge 
so I think that would look really cute hanging like that plus it gives your page a little decoration and the edge of it I love the way fabrics look hanging out your book um, so that is that's perfect so we're gonna add a little glue here and we're gonna add this bow cuz I'm digging this bow I like it there we go make sure it's on there good and get the glue off my finger okay so there is a tab and it is going to look adorable on the side of your of your signature just hanging out looking all awesome so there is that I'm gonna do some um, that's what I'm gonna do with these bows I'm gonna I'm gonna make these tabs and, and put them on there I think that is an awesome idea I do uh, let's fold this my cutting when I fussy cut it is not even at all it looks insane and I think for this one I'm just gonna glue these little these little end pieces on my my tab so I'm just gonna take a touch of glue and then I'm going to add it like that there we go oops I think that looks cute guys I do yes I do let's see what other one do we have I don't, really use, I don't think I want to use that one I don't want to use a you know a real big one on the on the side of this I think that's gonna to be too much honestly I don't know I might like it and you can also put these tabs on the top of your page instead of on the side yeah, I don't like that. I really don't. I don't. I think that's too much. So, but we can add this one here. That'd be cute. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna add that, and then you could put bling and whatever you want in the center of these to dress it up a little bit more. Um, I don't know what kind of bling. I don't think I got any bling back here, to be honest with you guys. Um, I've got some little things in here, but I think these are going to be too big. You know, like that is definitely too big. I mean, I could put it there since it's going to be hanging out the book. Like, I think that'll look cool. But I think it, honestly, I think that one's too big. You know, like that one there is too big. So, I don't have any bling back here. I think I took all of it in the front room where I'm crafting now. Hmm, let me think. <coughs> let me think here. Hmm, yeah, I took it all in the front room. So, no big deal. No big deal. So, that is how I make these simple little bowls. And these would be just you know nice to make up and have them in your stash so when you want a bow for a project you've already got them made my camera keeps moving stupid thing okay so guys there is my craft with me video today i hope you guys enjoyed this if you did let me know leave a comment you know if you make any of these i've got the links to my group my link to my group down below um, if you make any, share them in there. Uh, leave your thoughts. You know, all that fun stuff. So, I'm up off here. Thank you, guys. Uh, make sure you check out Deb, her Etsy shop. Grab this kit. Grab some of the other kits she has. Check out all the design team members. Everything is down below. Y'all have a great day. And as always, goodbye, God bless, and I'll see y'all again soon.